ओके गाइस गुड इवनिंग दिस इज रिंकेश पटेल मैकेनिकल इंजीनियर ओके लेट्स स्टार्ट वेल इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल शो यू हाउ टू यूज स्प्लिट बॉडी ट्रिम एंड एक्सटेंड ट्रिम शीट डिवाइड फेस एंड ट्रिम बॉडी ओके सो लेट्स स्टार्ट नाउ आई एम क्रिएटिंग फर्स्ट ए सिंपल पार्ट सो आई कैन हेल्प यू okay this is the simple rectangular box 100 by 50 okay this one is okay now you can place anywhere this okay now it's done okay finish catch and extrude as you know now this is select in front curve you can uh, select all the sketch in one click okay so this is how okay, now you can give the uh, parameters you want to use okay now there none okay this is done now you can hide the sketch for by right clicking of it and then hide okay you can hide this uh, coordinate system dot hide okay now we are going to trim this body uh, by its half of size okay now we can measure the size of its distance measure click first this and second one is we know that uh, this is the 100 mm long okay now select the trim body and you can see that there is two option target tools setting preview but uh, we are only considered two options target and tools setting it is the tolerance you can give it as as it is okay this is preview you can show this preview okay now the target we are going to select the body which uh, we want to trim the body okay then uh, we are going uh, to select this body okay now tools the tools is the most important thing in trim body because we are going to uh, trim the body by this tool so we have to select any face or any dotum or uh, any plan okay here we can see that there is two options face or plan and new plan we can select face or plan but uh, we cannot uh, done the with this because there is no any uh, intersection plan or face so we have to select new okay now you can see that this is informed datum okay now select the face and uh, this will give you opportunity to create the body okay uh -huh. we are reversing the direction and uh, this is 50 okay now you are seeing this preview okay if you want to uh, cut this side area i mean vice versa you can change the reverse the direction okay and this is done okay i think this will help you okay now we are reversing it and using another option split body in the trim body you can see that uh, this will delete the partial body and in the split body it will trim the body but not completely it will uh, give you two segment where you trim the body where you split the body okay here also there is two option target and tools face or plan new plan here extrude and revolve we will uh, introduce this extrude and revolve in next tutorial okay now we are uh, selecting this plan and reverse the direction and giving the distance 50 okay done preview okay we see that this is the two bodies 
okay if you have confusing and you can uh, uh, you can't uh, actually see that and if you want to clear these things you can uh, press control b b for bangalore okay now class selection here in the menu bar you can select the solid body okay and now you can select two bodies different okay we are done with this okay we are deleting this okay now uh, there are another option divide face okay actually uh, if you are beginner you can't under understand this divide face but uh, if you are using Siemens NX this is best feature ever I see in Siemens NX okay if you are uh, uh, divide to uh, divide the any face in two segment or in any geometry we are just uh, sketch the um, body and uh, okay done finish the sketch okay now if we are if you want to split this one face by this line we are going to select divide face select the face and object line by two points you can select the line between two points offset curve in face or isoparametric curves we are selecting isoparametric curve oh sorry set curve in face on we can select okay yes and offset is 0 okay now this is the normal to face setting already tolerance given and we can see that okay now we are hiding this sketch ha huh, and done we can see this is the two face and in the bottom there is one press only so these these features only split the face not body not completely body so you can use the synchronized modeling tool pull the face by using this and you can pull only one face but this is this is most most usable thing in Siemens sense okay now we are going to uh, uh, we are going to see trim sheet and trim and action uh, these both uh, are used uh, mainly used in uh, surface designing okay we are uh, sketching the sketch okay and uh, we are basically use uh, okay studio curve okay yes yes okay You can see this is the undesired card and extrude. Okay, we are going to extrude it by sheet. Okay, now we have to extrude a new face, a new surface that is intersecting this surface. Then we can uh, use the future trim sheet or trim bend extent okay before trim sheet we are using trim and extend these uh, tools is basically used for extending the sheet in, uh, sheet we are uh, selecting the any one uh, corner or sorry not corner but any one side of uh, sheet and we can see that there is a given distance we can adjust by this this and this okay we are selecting 10 okay i think i hope you can this is the natural or natural tangent and uh, minor if you are using the uh, complex geometry you can uh, you can introduce by this uh, three now you can get a difference between these three options 
okay this is simple percentage of measure this is the basically if you have 100 percent uh, 100 mm length sheet and uh, you are selecting percent of measure and you are editing tw uh, 20 percent then it will automatically consider the 20 percent of whole th uh, whole length of sheet sheet okay until selected if you have uh, an anything wall or uh, end or anything then you can select this and this will extend the sheet until selected okay you can make corner okay but we are using by distance okay uh, we are hiding this sketch uh, and uh, we are going to make a new sheet uh, sketching okay now you can see that this is uh, showing a curve only because it is sheet simple and uh, we are also going to make a new sheet okay uh, uh, hmm. okay we are actually doing it huh. now you can see that this is extruding it the uh, parallel to our old sheet but you can change the direction by giving this vector zc oh sorry not zc yc okay you can see that wow okay now we are extruding this until it uh, intersect uh, the old sheet okay now here none okay and now you can see that these both sheets are intersecting each other okay now we are using the trim sheet okay the target the target is obviously you know that we are selecting this sheet now if you are select here this segment of uh, sheet it will keep this segment if here selected and if you are select this the uh, this option will keep this segment okay uh, let me show you okay we are selecting this by uh, clicking in this segment okay boundary objects we can select this okay now if you are uh, selecting here keep it will keep this portion and discard this portion and if you are select discard portion this will discard it and this will give hmm. now you can see that yes and discard it okay you can see that okay so guys I hope this tutorial will help you and uh, this is first time i am recording this tutorial with vocal so sorry for english and uh, i will try my level best in next tutorial okay i will come with next tutorial okay thank you